ni di malang absheni. Hello, it's all in the queen. Tita! <laughs> Hi guys, I hope you are well. Today is the 1st of September. It's a new month. Yay, 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 yay! It's spring, but it's a bit chilly. And so I'm wearing a jacket and I'm still wearing my winter clothes. Um, but I'm so excited to share with you guys that I finally got my official Come on. Let's throw it away. So I'm so excited, guys, because I got my official passport. I applied for first and foremost. Can I just give Home Office a round of applause? Because wow, the level of efficiency. But it's very, very unfortunate because only the efficiency part of this department efficiently works only for official purposes or for official officials <laughs> so for me okay I'm, I'm happy like i'm really happy about the service i'm really satisfied and it exceeded bona it exceeded my expectations like a thousand times i honestly thought i'd get my passport sometime next week i applied for it on monday as i told you guys you've been watching the video and i've been updating you on Monday, uh, which was the 29th of August. And then um, I made a call yesterday just to find out how far and how long it would take so that I can, you know, prepare my mind mentally for the long duration and just the waiting, the agony of the waiting, because I'm honestly worried about our visas. We've not applied for visas. And I know sometimes visas can be a delay and it can prohibit you from traveling. So that is my panic mode, but nonetheless, I applied on Monday and I got my SMS literally like probably 10 minutes ago and I went out 10 minutes ago. Immediately when I got the SMS, I left and went to the office. Office is just next door my street where I work. So I was really glad that I actually did it around the parameters and surroundings of my office. So it can be much easier for me to move from here and here and do the necessary procedures and steps. So I'm going to show you guys um my visa but oh my gosh i need to probably blur some things here because it does have my particulars and i can't share my particulars online guys yeah for security reasons because we do have people that are out there to do some funny things so first and foremost the service was great i'm gonna give them like a 10 over 10 i'll give them an 11 because they exceeded my expectations my passport was done in three days literally because this is the fourth day and fourth day's delivery and they were efficient enough to send me today they could have sent me the sms tomorrow morning but i got this the sms instantly and then funny thing i got to the um the service office and then i told them i'm here to pick up a passport and then they said i have to wait in a queue and i said okay this is not a personal passport it's an official passport it's like oh why didn't you say no just then they gave me a ticket instantly within two minutes they called my ticket i got my passport literally i was in that office for five minutes and i was like and people were shocked but i had to tell they had to explain to them that this is like an official uh, person so we treat them differently and i'm like wow why can't this happen every day <laughs> why can't it happen every day like literally i spent five minutes five minutes in and out and i'm back in my office so guys i'm so happy about the service they were very helpful no attitude no funny business it was spectacular happy i'm happy and i finally have it so the first difference that you notice is the color the color of your, the passport is green and as you can see it's written the official passport and it's also written in french so this is how the passport looks like it's so pretty i love my picture i look like some ambassador <laughs> of some country <laughs> guys it's so beautiful now we're starting to plan only now will i start booking airlines uh, accommodation oh gosh i'm so excited this trip is now be beginning so the next step is a visa so i'm going to quickly explain to you the visa how it breaks our department is to write a letter to deco uh stating my reasons for travel and to allow them an easy breezy process for me to go and process my visa with the embassy straight so 
once that process is approved by deco they will give me some okay they will forward the letter i think to the embassy and i'd have to go to um the united emirates um em em united emirates dubai yes united emirates dubai embassy and go and get my visa so that is how the official process works but because i'm traveling with a child um once i get mine i have to apply for the child at the same time and then have a copy of my visa on his so the process cannot be declined because if he um if he applies now i have been um advised by the agent that we are using that they will definitely decline it because this child is just a foreigner and he's a minor and all of that there's so many things that goes into approving a visa for a child so everything is dependent on my processes so today hopefully by next week i should have an update as to how far things are and then i'll give you an update but i'm so excited and i'm ending this video so you guys saw the entire process of how i have had to apply for my first official passport and i'm so happy to have shared this journey with you guys if you need more of this content you know what you got to do hit on that subscribe button do like comment and definitely share with your friends guys and i'll see you yet again in another video where i update you about the visa process enjoy bye bye love you bye